Controversial cleric Paul Ntenge Mackenzie, 94 other people accused of terrorism and radicalization in Shakahola have denied charges leveled against them by the state. The 95 suspects produced in the Shanza law courts are facing five counts under terrorism and radicalization offenses. And as Brenda Wanga now reports, this is the second court appearance for Mackenzie in as many days. After spending months in remand, Paul Mackenzie led his followers under heavy police presence into the Shanzu law courts in Mombasa. The suspects in the Shakahola massacre, numbering nearly 100, took up the entire courtroom as they waited to hear what charges the state would bring against them. Uh, the prosecution's team laid out the charges that warranted the suspects to be brought before this counter-terrorism court. The suspects, 95 in number, included Paul Mackenzie, his wife Roda Mumbua, his deputy Smart Makalama, his security chief Stephen Sanga, senior leader Kelvin Sudi Asena, and are facing a number of charges relating to terrorism and radicalization. Na mwaka ilifumbili na ishirina tatu, katika eneo la Furunzi, county ndogo ya Malindi, county ya Kilifi, mulipatika na mkimiliki maksudi, in count one, Mackenzie and 31 other suspects have been charged with engaging in organized criminal activity contrary to the Prevention of Organized Crimes Act of 2010. The prosecution states that the 32 suspects in the years between 2020 and 2023 as members of the Good News International Ministries, which they describe as an organized criminal group, engaged in criminal activities endangering lives and leading to the deaths of 429 people. All the accused are charged with radicalization contrary to the Prevention of Terrorism Act with the prosecution accusing them of promoting an extreme belief system for the purpose of facilitating ideologically based violence to wit fasting to death. Mackenzie and his deputy Smart Makalama faced two other counts of facilitating the commission of a terrorist act and being in possession of an article connected with an offense under the Prevention of Terrorism Act. They are accused of transporting people to Shakahola and endangering their lives, as well as having CDs, DVDs, books and pamphlets for use in instigating the commission of a terrorist act. They all denied the charges against them and have been remanded until the 18th of February when their case will be mentioned again. Mackenzie appeared in court on Wednesday to face murder charges, but was instructed to undergo a mental examination to find out if he and his co-accused were fit to stand trial. Mackenzie and the other accused will also be facing more charges in the children's court in Tononoka, Mombasa. He will be charged for violating the rights of children of Shakahola. Brenda Wanga, Citizen TV.